I grew up in Varna, Bulgaria, which a lot of people are familiar with the current situation with Ukraine and we're just a few miles across the sea from Ukraine, so kind of on the other uh, side of the Black Sea, geographically, that helps. And I was 19 when I came to college to play basketball. And I did my undergraduate school a long time ago when I was younger in a different school. I was on basketball scholarship, which was a blessing. Then I went back to Europe for a long, long time and never thought I would be back to the States. However, again, under God's grace, I did come back. My basketball coach back then invited me just for a visit and I stayed and I'm still here. So anyway, I did finish my undergraduate many, many years later at NNU in 2017. When I f finished my undergrad, I said, no more school, this is just too much, never again. But again, Professor Curran kind of encouraged me throughout the whole way while living with her. She thought that I had good people skills, which I believe are very important in social work. And she thought I was talented enough to go on to graduate school. That was kind of the first step. And she actually encouraged me to take just one class at the social work program, just to see how I feel about it. And I don't have to go on. That's what I did. And of course, I fell in love with social work. So the rest is history. I love the fact that we would encourage, especially for someone like me who English is a barrier, barrier and it's always going to be, we're encouraged to write a lot and become more proficient in our writing. So not to scare anyone, there's a lot of writing, but it's so incredibly helpful. I believe I've improved a lot. So someone who is thinking of being, becoming a social worker should know that we would write a lot throughout all our lives. And I was a little bit skeptical in the beginning because I wasn't sure how much my faith and social work would correlate. And I had moments where I was doubtful, but the more I got into the program, I saw how much we as social workers could serve the people who are most unprivileged here. And I, I say that with an open heart because I lived in a country where social work doesn't really exist. Just we, the government just really never have, um, has finances to support the people who are most struggling. So I think it's fascinating to see how much resources there are here and how they can be used to help some people who I really need help most. So just the serving part was what drew me. I believe God has given me a serving heart, so that was in the basis of it.